morning, guys. Welcome to Whiskey and Sunshine Off Grid. Beautiful morning, sun shining, and I'm trying not to squint and make my scowl lines. Good Lord, I can't, I can't do it. The sun's right, right behind the camera pretty much. But that sky is beautiful today. Nice blue, blue sky. It's a few clouds, but not many. So it's a gorgeous day. Panels are gonna be getting, or they're probably making power now, but but uh, they'll be getting some more sun and making some really good power here right off. So that's good. Uh, it's about 28 degrees in the shade right now, but the sun feels so much warmer, uh, feels so good. I think today is supposed to be in the 50s. Wow. Love it. So happy about that. Um, just so excited. So I think we're going to go finish getting the rest of our stuff to do the maple syrup um, to collect it. We haven't tapped the trees yet or anything like that. It's been not warm enough. The past few days have, but Scott's been working, so it's not warm enough to um, to tap them here. I mean, maybe, maybe it is, but... Um, we just haven't had the time. Um, and this is something Scott wants to do, so I don't want to take that away from him. So um, he's pretty excited to, to go out and pick up some stuff. So maybe we'll take you along for that. I don't know if it'll be in this video. But uh, I was enjoying being outside with the chickens this morning with the sun shining. And um, so I just thought I'd show you a few things that I've been noticing around the yard and watching my chickens because they're they're very interesting very interesting um <laughs> they're just so funny to watch anyway so here's a few clips i've taken just this morning Big interest in the coffee uh, bucket today. That's my compost bucket. <laughs> Yeti was explaining to him that she brings out this yummy stuff and throws it in a big old pile and you can go over and dig through it. <laughs> Look at these naughty little buggers on the compost. Naughty. I wish I could block them out, but uh, my fence is down. <laughs> Thanks, Storm. Oh well, stir it up, girls. Hopefully you guys can see that. I was just looking at the panels. And I realized that they're all frosty on all those but those first two over here are not because the sun's hitting those that's where it hits first the sun's right there right up there so you can see where the sun hits first we've got a couple weeks and we'll be changing these to the um, the flatter they'll be facing the sky more because the sun will be up in the sky higher. So we'll be doing that, changing them with the equinox. Like we do in the fall, we change them to this setting so they're more straight up and down to get the lower sun. And then when 
they, as the sun goes up higher, we'll change them so that they're flatter to the sky to catch more of the sun. But I thought that was interesting. As, as I'm videoing this, I can see the frost going out of the panels. So funny story time with Yeti this morning. Um, a guy came, there was two of them, they came and they had one down at the end of the road, our driveway, and um, they had one up at the house and they had to go turn something on or do some things and the other one had to, I don't know. Anyway, they were, they were here and um, B, our hound dog, pretty much slept through the whole thing. She didn't even know anybody was here till he came in the house and was working on the internet. Um, but Yeti knew and Yeti was outside and he was over by the tractor. So it was a ways away, but he was keeping an eye on him. And it was really funny to watch because one of the girls kind of started to mosey over to where they were. And uh, he was like, uh, I don't think so miss uh happy pants to go over and greet the strangers so <laughs> he went over and he's like dancing around her trying to get her to come back with the rest of the group and around the corner but he was keeping an eye on those guys it was pretty funny <laughs> it was cracking me up it's funny to see how they interact and how protective he is he's very protective it's pretty awesome Just watching them all hanging out over by the uh, by the house. I'll have to show you guys. This is the place to be in the morning, I guess. Everybody huddled up there. The sun is shining. Feels really good. <laughs> the sun always hits there in the morning. Actually, most of the day. And that was all snow not too long ago, just a few days ago. Starting to warm up and thaw out. I mean, we still could get some big storms, but um, hopefully it won't last long. So funny, I know this isn't a flattering view for me, but wow, is that sky beautiful. It's gorgeous this morning. Look at those wispy clouds, beautiful. So pretty. And it's getting louder. The road's getting louder. Um, you know, as the snow goes away and the air changes, that happens. We get a little bit louder for a while until the leaves pop out on the trees or even just start budding out. It kind of gives that barrier so you don't hear it so much, but it carries up this up the road and up this hill. Um, so much for a little while it does it in the fall too when the leaves fall off so um but you know it it is what it is you got to endure for a little while just like winter we got to endure it for a little while just to get to the the parts that we like which is the spring summer and fall so but um yeah we're pretty excited to start our maple syrup journey and see how much we're going to get and if we do a good job and not burn it <laughs> and hopefully it's going to taste good but um yeah pretty excited about it so the girls are really loving it in the sun this morning and yeti they're pretty happy out here it is pretty beautiful it's warm enough to come out in a sweatshirt so pretty Pretty happy about that. I'm sick of the bulky clothes. I am still wearing boots, but that's because it's muddy and there's lots of poop between dog and chickens. And it's just easier to clean one pair of shoes than a bunch of pair of shoes after you get stuff on the bottom of them, if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> anyway, guys, thanks for hanging out with me this morning. It's beautiful. And we're looking forward to a nice day. And hopefully we'll have some maple syrup stuff soon. Um, and uh, not sure how much of a how-to it's going to be. Because again, it's, it's really our first time doing it. So we'll see how that turns out. And you guys, we'll bring you along for the journey anyway. 
and see how we do. But anyway, guys, take care. Have a good day and we'll see you next time. Mm -hmm.